Hello, OpenSCAP and SCAP Security Guide can scan bare metal and virtual machines for compliance and the results are well defined. But scanning containers and container images can bring some false negative results because rules and probes were developed with bare metal machines in mind. We have done some work in SCAP Security Guide to make results of scanning a container. Let's see how they look like. I've got here the latest upstream data stream for RHEL 7 and uh, a docker container image of rel7 and here the latest data stream the same data stream in a rel7 virtual machine let's scan both for pcr compliance scanning is done gather the results and let's take a look at them On the left side we have the report for the container and on the right side the report of the virtual machine. We can see that the more rules were checked on the virtual machine than in the container. The container has failed more rules than the virtual machine. Let's take a quick look at the results. A little trick here. Okay. Uh, first fail in the container side is that it doesn't have the GPG key for checking the packages, which looks legit. Uh, the container does not have a AID installed. And verify some RPM permissions. And here, a rule which is marked as not applicable. What does it mean? It means that this rule does not make sense in containers like screen locking in containers okay uh, continuing taking a look at the rules some fails on the container side related to passwords rules marked as not applicable and this is marked as not applicable because it's hard to check some some rules for passwords because there might be some they might be stored somewhere else and as it's a container image it might not be possible to check it um, failing rules for passwords and here more rules that does not apply well for containers which is related to bootloading uh, smart card logging is not enabled in container so it's a legit fail some packages not installed, versus log not configured. Here, audit is is marked as not applicable because uh, the whole SC Linux will light audit and tell that it's it's not enabled, and uh, there can be only op it's not checked on containers. Uh, three fails in services for containers related to network time protocol and those are the rules on the report and so we can see that rules that doesn't make sense for containers are marked as not applicable and failed rules look legit and need to be checked in the container 